Yo, what is up guys? It's your boy G Money Pops and today we have another mystery box from Poptopia. All right guys, so let's get into this mystery box and see what we got exactly. I hope I get some more chases. Maybe a grail. That would be great. All right, so we got our paper on top. And there is six, six uh, total pops in here. We got our three hits that we picked, three boxes, and then they send the three commons. So we have a total of six pops. Underneath, there's another three pops stacked on top of each other. So pop number one. We're going to save the hits for last, so if this is a hit, this is a hit, so we're going to save this as last, and the, to know that this is a hit, it's got a post-it note with a number, so that's how I know that's a hit. Alright, so this is a common, guys. Let's open it up and see what we got. What is it? What did we get? We got the Umbrella Academy. The Cha-Cha. It's the Cha-Cha, guys. There's the Cha-Cha. Alright, moving on. Let's see if we can find another common. Alright, so this is a common, guys. So let's see what we got. What is it? Oh, wow. We got a Toy Story pop. We got Mr. Wheezy. Wheezy he is. Mr. Wheezy. Not bad pretty cool that's what he looks like he's holding a microphone all right let's try to find our third and last common pop before we open up our hits this is a hit All right, this is a common, guys, so let's see what this is. Wow, we got Dr. Raymond from Ghostbusters. Dr. Raymond Stance. Wow. He's pretty cool, guys. Check him out. He is pretty neat. Alright, so those are our three common pops. Now let's uh, start opening up our main hits. See, see what we got. Alright, so there's one hit here. And this is hit number. This is hit number six. Let's see what we got. Uh-oh, we got the Fantastic Four. Looks like a GameStop only exclusive. The Invisible Girl, guys. This is the Fantastic Four GameStop exclusive only. The Invisible Girl. Okay. Not bad. I don't know value on these, so we are going to check at the end of all our pops and see what our total value is. Let's go on to hit number two. This is number number seven. Let's see what we got. And we got a Star Wars. Looks like a Darth Vader. An FYE exclusive. This is, oh, this is actually a Knight of Ren. Heavy Blade edition. Okay. 
FYE exclusive. Not bad. All right, let's open up our last and final hit. And this is hit number 12. Hit number 12. What do we have? Oh, ho, ho, ho. we got ourselves a Rick and Morty pop. An Amazon exclusive and looks like it's a glow in the dark. Okay, we got a glow in the dark. Uh hologram rick clone i believe this is a brand new pop i think this just came out not too long ago correct me if i'm wrong down in the comments but i believe this pop just came out all right guys so that was the last pop so now let's uh look up total values and see what see how well we did all right guys so let's go ahead and check value on these pops that we we've received today and let's go ahead and start with the common pops. So let's start with Dr. Raymond from the Ghostbusters. Uh, very nice looking pop. Very uh, mint condition. No damage. And it's pop protector. Every pop from Poptopia comes in a pop protector. So that's another good thing about this website. Okay, so here he, here he is right here. And he is worth $8. On to the next one, we have Cha Cha from the Umbrella Academy. Go ahead and look Cha Cha up. Pretty cool, he's holding a gun. Right here he is, he is worth $9, guys. So let's go ahead and add him up. So right now, with these two common pops that we just checked out, we're at $17 in value. Add him to the collection. Uh, forgot to add him to the collection okay so there we go now let's go ahead and look up our last common pop which is the toy story wheezy it's a penguin with a microphone and this pop is not in mint condition he actually has um some damage to his nose his yellow beak i don't know if you can see it with the camera but he is, let's see, his beak is like got a big chunk missing out of it. I don't know if you'll be able to see it with the camera. Alright, so Wheezy is only worth $6 anyway. So, yeah, I'm probably just going to end up giving this pop away. Maybe a future giveaway on the channel, so make sure you subscribe. And we'll definitely be doing some giveaways. We got three hits here. We're gonna look up, and it is the very first one is the Knight of Ren, the one that I thought was Darth Vader, and it's a Fye exclusive. Okay, so here he is. He is only worth seventeen dollars. I thought he would at least be worth worth twenty, but I guess not. So let's go ahead and add seventeen dollars to the. All right, so now we're at thirty-four dollars, guys. We have two pops left to look. So let's go ahead and look up the Invisible Girl from Fantastic Four. And this is a GameStop exclusive only. And she is the transparent version. Okay, here she is. She is the transluent, translucent version. The Invisible Girl, $20. Let's go ahead and add that to our collection and add $20. All right, we're now we're at a total of $54, guys. So let's go ahead and check out our last pop. It was a Rick and Morty Amazon exclusive only. And it's a glow in the dark. It is a pretty cool pop. I like this pop. It's pretty cool. All right. So let's go ahead and look him up. Yep. All right, here he is. He is worth $22, guys. Let's add him to our collection. And let's add $22. No. Nope. Wow. 
So guys, this was not a decent mystery box for me for value because I bought three. We just opened up three mystery boxes. They always pack it in. They consolidate it into a bigger box um, for shipping costs reasons. But uh, yeah, so I spent 75. I made $1. So I basically broke even. <clears throat> but that is their guarantee. At least you won't get anything under value. Um, you would get at least your money back in value. So that's the whole part of it being a mystery box. You saw uh, a couple days ago when I opened up the $100 value mystery boxes. I made out really good on that one. $52 profit. And today we only made a dollar profit. But uh, I chose the numbers. So it's basically my fault. If I wasn't lucky enough to choose the bigger number hits, I guess. Uh, but there's always next time. Uh, Please like and subscribe to the video guys and also uh, let me know down in the comments if you think I should do this again in the future. Um, it's pretty fun guys, um, but I'm not going to continue to do it if you guys don't want to see me do it. So let me know down in the comments if you really like to see a future video of mystery boxes and not, and not necessarily the same website, I'll, I'll even do different ones. If you guys recommend a mystery box site, I would definitely check it out and probably try it out. Alright guys, so uh, thanks for watching and once again, uh, like and subscribe. Thank you. I appreciate you guys. Have an awesome day.